Hello and welcome to my channel. I'm Mystic Rose and today we're going to be talking all about your ascendant sign in the sign of Leo. Fabulous Leo. And we're going to talk about what exactly is the ascendant sign um, and what does that mean and how does it affect you. So what is your ascendant sign? Well, your ascendant sign is the sign that was rising in the eastern hemisphere on the day that you were born. And it's um, how you basically um, appear to the world when they first meet you. And it also denotes your physical characteristics and what you look like. Um, so the thing about the ascendant sign is that when you're calculating it in your birth chart calculator, you have to have the exact time of birth. If you're off like an hour or even a few minutes, it could affect the whole sign and it could change it. So, you know, um, it's very um, particular as far as putting in the exact time. So, um, but if you know that you are uh, a Leo Ascendant and you've already put in your correct um, time for your birth chart calculator, you're in the right place. And if maybe this video is for you, if you have your Leo, if you have a Leo Ascendant, or maybe you know somebody who has a Leo Ascendant and you just want to have more information about them, you're in the right place. Um, so what does, what exactly does um, the Leo Ascendant look like? Well, because they're the lion and they have such a beautiful mane, um, their hair is going to be very full and rich. Oftentimes it's like a honey brown color, but it doesn't have to be. Um, it's always thick though and full and just luscious hair. And they're usually like, they look a lot younger than their actual years. And they have a charming smile. Sometimes they're um, considered a little bit big boned. Although they may be of average height, they can have broad shoulders and um, they're about medium to large build. Average height and they, they can look rather athletic and muscularly built. Um, as far as like the personality traits, the things that you actually portray into the world and how people perceive you when they first meet you, they may think that you're very adaptable and that you can survive in a lot of different situations and circumstances because people see that, see that like you're very resilient in life and you bounce right back. Um, they also might see that you kind of need constant attention because with the Leos, they love to be in the spotlight. Um, and Leo ascendants are no different than the sun sign. They love this attention they um they can kind of fall into the trap of like being a little bit too needy for attention so it's just something to kind of keep an eye out for um but they're they have really fun loving personalities everybody loves them they are attention grabbers like they're just inherently charming people um they're very extroverted and they love people they're quite analytical when they're thinking about things. They um, they like to think about situations and think deeply about things and analyze things from different perspectives. Um, this would make them a great detective. They also love to just um, read literature. They um, are very interested in artwork. A lot of them are very artistic themselves, but they're definitely art appreciators. And they are very um, keen on music and painting and poetry or anything of that artistic nature. Leo Ascendants can fall into the trap, though, of being a little bit of a megalomaniac at times. But they're also very caring, very, you know, warm and joyous and high spirited. Um, they don't keep grudges against people. You know, they just they let things go and um they don't hold on to things that bother them for too long and they kind of enjoy being on their own they enjoy being with other people but they also enjoy like being on their own they can be very independent they're really good at noticing like what's good about other people and pointing it out and appreciating the good in others they're so kind 
they um they have good character about them and they will go out of their way to keep their friends and family happy and taken care of but their need for attention can also make them seem a little bit selfish at times they're not really selfish but it can make them seem like they're selfish because they need the constant admiration and it can be a little bit frustrating to people around them at times the Leo Ascendant is also very confident. They have such high self-esteem, um, but they have a very you know, loving heart and they're very magnetic and their partners and just friends find them to be extremely attractive and are drawn to them because they're very loyal in friendships and relationships. Um, they have like the sense of awareness, like self-awareness and they always just need to express themselves in like this artistic manner. It's very important to them. And they're very, they mature as time goes on. So they might be a little bit immature in their younger years, but as time goes on, they really mature. And they try to find different like artistic and professional avenues to make themselves heard. As they mature, they just want to be heard more and more. Um, and their primary goal and desire is to excel in whatever profession that they choose or, um, you know, whatever they choose, they want to be good at it. They grow up to be confident, generous people, um, or else they might, um, if they don't do that, then sometimes they can be a little bit uh, extravagant towards others um, which could actually like be sort of the reason for that could be like mainly a, uh, a, a hidden insecurity within them and uh, they are just they're the life of the party so like when they walk in they just steal the show everybody starts talking to them and they're they're just happy that they're there and they're exciting, you know, they're passionate. And they are a fire sign, so of course they're very passionate. Their lucky numbers include one, five, and nine. And their lucky colors are golden, orange, yellow, cream, and red. And I will say too, that um, they look fabulous in gold jewelry. And they can pull off all kinds of like looks that other people can't pull off. They can just pull off like big jewelry, gaudy jewelry, um, loud clothing statements that other people just can't pull off. But they have this confidence and they're able to pull things off. So that's really cool about Leo Ascendants too. And um, there are famous people with their... Um, with Leo Ascendant as well. And uh, one of those people is, are um, Johnny Depp. He has his Leo Ascendant. Um, actually, if you think about Johnny Depp and his, he has like, he's known for kind of a temper, but he's also got his own unique style about him. And he can pull off all kinds of strange looks and still look good. Um, that is because of his Leo ascendant, and um, a lot of people might not know it, but he's also an artist, and he he does some wonderful paintings. So um, definitely check that out if uh, if you're just finding out about Johnny Depp's art. He's pretty cool. Um, anyways, uh, well, that's about it for the Leo ascendant person. I'm so glad that you tuned in today. And if you've liked this video, I hope that you uh, give me a thumbs up and share with friends. Definitely subscribe to my channel if you haven't done that yet, because I love to grow my channel and I love to welcome in new members. So, um, and also if you would like to donate to my channel to help my channel to grow, um, the information for that is in the um, description box below. Thanks again so much for being here. Check out my other videos. I've got a lot of other great videos and a lot of good videos to come. Um, I'm going to be putting out some videos about um, your aura and how to protect yourself and then how to communicate with spirit guides. And I'm really excited about putting out those videos too. 
as soon as I'm done here with the uh, ascendant signs. So there's going to be lots of exciting videos to come, so be sure to stay tuned. And thanks so much, and many blessings to you.